and welcome back to another ship hunting video here at the game hub on no man's sky today i'm bringing you 14 new sentinel ship locations all of these were recorded on a live stream and most of them were picked by the viewers now in total there are over 580 ship locations on the channel now so check them out if you haven't seen them already now we also do live streams try to do them daily so there's lots of exclusive finds you won't find in videos in those playbacks now you can also submit your ship finds and find other ship finds in the discord so check that out every ship i show today is based in the euclid galaxy that is important now if there is any bases that cause issues be sure to report them save your game reload and then get your ship multiplayer must be disabled to save issues and as always, combos will be placed at every ship's location. So, it's that time. Let's go. Ship number one now then. Class S. Color scheme on this one is yellow and black. Coordinates, portal address, top of the screen. And remember, if you skip the intro, all these are in Euclid. Remember that. Now, the supercharged slots on this first one, we've got two on the right and one on the left initially. Once you've unlocked that other slot, you can see two on the right and two towards the middle. Now, in the air, this thing does look quite nice. It doesn't change too much other than the wings do slightly dip, but again, it looks very gracious in the air. Yellow and black, lovely. Next. Right, ship number two on the list today then. This one is a Class A ship. Again, coordinates, portal address, top of the screen. Color scheme on this one comes in green and black and it has those lovely little mini wings top and bottom very nice supercharged slots as an a class we can only see two initially once you've upgraded it all uh, you can see three towards the middle not exactly grouped and the one on the right in the air though like i say the mini wings they do make this shape it's a lovely looking ship but do you like green that is the question let's move on next Right, ship number three in today's list now. This one is another Class A ship. This one comes in the color scheme of black and red, and it is a dragonfly shape here. Uh, we have the full size wings and the tank feet. Three eyes on the front, nice, nice. Uh, supercharged slots we can see as an A class, three over on the right, two that are grouped. As an S class, three are stacked together. Not a bad little layout, that one. Now in the air, all dragonflies look amazing if you ask me i am a big big dragonfly fan but this does look really nice do you like it next okay ship number four now on today's list this is another class a ship coordinates portal address top of the screen color scheme on this one comes in a black and very minimal mint green and it's literally just on the top there and the mini wings that you can see uh supercharged slots we have two on the right one on the left as an s class we have two, two, so not a bad little setup. Now in the air, uh, not a lot changes as it is a very simple ship. The boards do kind of dip down at a slight angle, but other than that, it holds its shape. Not bad, next. Okay, ship number five. This one is another class S ship here on the list now. Uh, coordinates, port address, top of the screen. Color scheme on this one is a teal and green dragonfly. It does have the skinny wings. Now, as for supercharged slots, let's take a look at them. We can see all four right from the get-go, but none of them are stacked. Now, in the air, it does look as you'd expect for a dragonfly, but that green does stand out. But me, I'm not a green fan, but I know many of you are. Lovely wingtips too. Next. Ship number six now, class S ship. Coordinates, portal address, top of the screen. The color scheme on this one comes in a very simple red. Now it's just a pure red bug body with a simple set of red wings. And then you have the extensions top and bottom with the prongs there too. Now supercharged slots, we can see two in the middle and one on the left initially. Once you've unlocked everything, it's one left, two middle, and then one slightly to the right. In the air, not a lot changes. Uh, it does hold a Thai style. Um, not the traditional Thai style that you'd expect to see, but either way, it's nice next okay ship number seven another class a ship on the list here coordinates portal address top of the screen the color scheme on this one comes in a simple black and white i do like this one now this one also holds some very nice supercharged slots so we've got two in the middle and one on the left as an a class once upgraded you have three tools the middle stacked and then one slightly to the left in the air this thing does look quite nice where it's very simple in style and very simple in color do you like the black and white ones i do let's move on next 
Right, ship number eight now on the list. This one is another Class S ship. Coordinates, portal address, top of the screen. Color scheme on this one comes in a glorious, fantastic orange. And it's a hauler. And I'll pick this one up. Hmm. Now, supercharged slots, two on the left, two on the right. Uh, I still can't get over this one. This one traumatized me on my live stream on Saturday. If you were there, you know. So if you know, you know. Hmm. There's still more to come from this ship, isn't there, Donald? Moving on. Next. Okay, ship number nine is another Class A ship on today's list. This one comes in blue. Now, it's kind of like a half tile with the uh, extended pointed top. Uh, it has the pipe thrusters that give it the extensions on the side there. It's not a bad looking ship. Supercharged slots, we have two on the right, one in the middle. Uh, once it's upgraded to S, that one in the middle turns to a stack of two in the middle, so two, two. Now in the air, like I say, it kind of looks like a half tie. Uh, I'm not really sure what to class this one as, if I'm honest. What would you class this ship style as? Let me know in the comments. Moving on, next. Okay, now ship number 10 in today's list. This one is another class A ship. Color scheme on this one is a very nice green. Now it's got fangs on it as well. Very simple in its layout, but also beautiful. Now supercharged slots we can see initially as an A, there's three over on the right, but once you've upgraded it to S, the fourth one is all the way over on the left, but that does not detract from the beauty of this ship. I don't like green ships, but this one, there's something about this one, it's just, it's just good. Next. Right, ship number 11. Class A ship, all the details you need are going to be top of the screen. Now, this is the second orange ship in today's collection, and the only saving grace for this ship was that big fat light on the front. So it got documented. Now, supercharged slots, we can only see one left, one right initially. Once you've upgraded fully, there's three over towards the right and one on the left. In the air, nothing's really going to change on this as it was on the ground, other than the wings dipping down. But like I say, that fat light saved it. It got documented. Next. Right. Ship number 12. All the details you need top of the screen. This is another Class S ship here. Color scheme on this one is black and white. It's a wingless ship, this one. Uh, but it's got mini wings, top and bottom. Uh, supercharged slots, we can see two on the right and two on the left straight off the bat. Like in the air, like I say, it's wingless, but it has those four mini wings. So if you like a small X-Wing style, this may suit your needs. Moving on, next. Okay, ship number 13 in the list now. This one is another Class A ship here. This one is a very simple bug, simple as they come with a wide front. So just a black or purple bug, and that's it. Now, supercharged slots, we have one on the right, one in the middle initially, once you've upgraded it to S class, two on the right and then two towards the middle. Now in flight, it looks exactly as it does on the ground, exactly as you'd expect. With the chicken legs tucked away, it's just a bug. Hmm, next. Okay, number 14, C class. Now wait, 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 wait. I deliberately chose the C class to document over the S class on this one. And that's purely because of the supercharged slots at the end result. Okay, so this is a beautiful white ship and once this C-Class is fully upgraded, you can see the supercharged slots are a stack of three and then the fourth one very close by. So if you have the means to upgrade this, I would suggest going for this one if you like this. There is an S-Class on the map also marked and an A-Class and a B-Class, but the slots are not as good. So check out this C-Class, it's beautiful. There we are, that is all 14 of today's finds. What did you like out of those 14? My favorite was number 14, regardless that I uh, used the C-Class version to upgrade. Didn't bother me, the end result for me is what does it look like with the supercharged slots when it's an S-Class? And that was by far the most superior. Now share all of your finds as well in our Discord. I'll put the link in the description and in the comments below. Now also let me know what are you after? If I haven't found it yet, let me know in the comments what style are you after? What color scheme are you after? Give me an idea of what I am missing. Now every live stream, when we land at a ship, I give the chat the choice, hunt or next. So if you want to be part of that decision, join one of my live streams. As always, thanks for watching 
and I'll see you in the next one.